Hey guys, it's Eagle Fog back with another video, and today I normally am in Star Stables, and it's been a while since I've been uploading, but today I thought I would, like, make a video on reviews of Star Stable. Now, yeah, because I, I like watch, oh, no, that's not, oh, sorry guys, but, um, I keep watching videos on how but how everybody records um, reviews. So let's just get into it. We're gonna start with the parents first. They look like pretty good reviews, but once you get down to the bottom, it doesn't look okay. So that's age age 10 plus five stars. That's pretty good. The reviews here is misleading. It's from an earlier version of the game. Okay. The review disappointed me because it's no longer accurate. There's a health bar and needs to fulfill. Wait, there's a health bar and needs to fulfill for a horse. Improved gra graphics, but they, they, but they. I can't read today. But they are still cartoonish. It's silly to think cinematic pictures and wallpapers on a site reflect real screenshots. It's fairly common, as it. Holy crap! That's a huge review. It is easy to tell now what tack and okay, I'm not gonna read this whole review guys because I don't know how okay this this the second one is better. So let's do the second one. Age eight plus five stars. And this one's a little shorter. Good. Right? Yeah. Continue reading. Okay. Lots of horse and fun. With an interest storyline and many fun characters, this game cap captures you from the very beginning. It's not just like a story that's ama- It's not just the story that's amazing about this this game either. There are so many different horse breeds available and many of them look more and move different from each other. Those the, through this game I've met some amazing friends and I recommend this game to everyone. Yes, same with me. But actually, some of the horses sort of almost move the same as other breeds. Like, like, um, the Fjord moves like the Swedish horse or whatever, the North Swedish. Just the, yeah. How long is this one? If, yeah, not this one. Let's not go to that one. Uh, report. Okay, this is age Four, this is going to be my last good one, and then I'll go to the bad ones. Age 4 plus. One of the best games. This is one of the best horse games out there. No imperit content or anything. All oh, kids should be allowed to play. That is true. Alright, next, this, um, okay, this one's not too long. Age 8 plus, 1 out of 5 stars. Beware of prices. St stable, Star Stable is free to play to level 5 on both your horse and avatar. However, after you have to pay for an upgrade, Star St Star Rider and Star Points currency to buy new horses and gear. Star Rider gain 100 Star Points a week. Nothing is comparison to the prices in the game. Then they'll have you buy Star Coins you, for for rather extreme prices for what you receive, and they'll be and they've been increasing the prices recently. I suggest finding something else to play. You'll end <coughs> you'll end up constantly dumping money into the game if you truly want to keep to date on new items. That is true. There, um, it is kind of outrageous. Eight dollars for um a hundred star coins. So guys, what I would do, if you do have money, and you're like deciding should I buy Star Coins for my game, and stay to level 5, or should I just buy Star Rider? I would just buy the Star Rider guys and save up, because, well, if you have enough, I would buy the Lifetime and then just save up from there, because if you buy the 1 month or 3 months, then you're going to have to, like, you know, um, keep having to be charged. So, okay, this one's done. Each 7 plus 1 out of 5 stars. Absolutely awful. So I came across this game, and it was rated far better than all the other horse games. My daughter, 11 at the time, was very happy about playing. She met many friends and played almost every night. Now she's 14, and Star Stable keeps closing her chat for no reason, and giving her warnings that she's done something, nothing wrong. 
Source Stable refuses to address that the new moderators are way too harsh and the customer support is very rude. On top of it all, on top of it all, my daughter rarely lays now. That's probably supposed to be plays now. She shows me the news feed, and it seemed to have gotten very bo boring. A complete waste of money at the time, so find a new game. Huh. Yeah, it's mostly just like this one. <laughs> um, okay, age 9 plus. After this one, we'll go to the kids' reviews. Customer service is terrible. My daughter loved this game and eventually convinced us to buy her membership as a gift. The problem began less than a month after the purchase. She somehow was either hacked or the game had a glitch and she was transferred to a world that she can't play in. Her level isn't high enough. We have been me messaging, emailing, begging, and complaining all for over a week and we have received absolutely no help. The one actual email received from the customer service cons consisted of one sentence, a level 12 cannot be in Pana. Completely unhelpful. So I'm tired of dealing with this. Yeah, I haven't had that happen to me yet, so it better not happen. I'm level 18 and I've been I am locked Pona. I haven't glitched like I've seen people glitch into a Pona or Dundle or anywhere, but I have never tried to glitch myself because that probably is not good. So we're gonna see the kids. Oh, these are more bad. Okay, um, age eight plus four out of five stars. Great for horse lovers. Star Stable is an amazing online horse game in which girls can care for as well as change. <laughs> as train and complete with their own virtual horses. The only issue are language and some degree of bullying, but both of these can easily be avoided by adult supervision during gameplay for younger kids. Mm. <laughs> the only thing I would say, if that person's bullying you, then I would probably just move to a different server. And if they keep finding you and bullying you, then I would report them or something. I don't think you really need supervision, but if you want supervision, like if your parents is, insist, like, honey, I need to watch you do this in case there's something bad in the game. I just make sure you're okay. So, like that. If your parents insist to supervise you, then I would say yes, but... If you can do it on your own and just move to a different server or make your computer a different language and move to a, like a region where they can't go, then I would do that. So, age 12 plus, one out of five stars. Hold on, I just want to make sure I'm still recording. Okay. This is a horrible game. This is a very bad game. I tried it and played it for about five minutes, and then I got it got boring. First of all, it gives you no direction on how to do half of the stuff, like feeding and caring for your horse. For, for instance, it does tell you how to do that, but you need to figure out yourself where, where the direction to complete this quest are. Hold up. Plus, you can probably move about five steps before running into something and having to call for pickup. Not to mention that there are different servers and when one of these servers gets full, you have to go through all the trouble of finding a new server and you'll lose all your friends in the old one. The game has very many flaws and improvements it, it can make. I personally don't think the game was even ready for a release. After level 5, it makes you pay $74 for a lifetime membership. Total ripoff. Minecraft is only, what, $25 lifetime membership? It, it is way better in terms of program. It also has horses you can ride, then Star Stable. I would consider not even bothering with this game, unless you are a huge fan of horses. Um, you don't really have to be a huge fan of horses to play this game. Like, if, if you like the animal, but you're not, like, a mega huge... You could probably still play the game to low five, like, if you're not a mega huge where you're like, I gotta get all these horses, <laughs> then you could probably just play to level five, but if you're a mega, then it depends if you want to save up, because what I would do is just save up money, like, mow the lawn, because I mow the lawn, and I get pretty, I get paid pretty good, so, and I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm trying to save up my money right now, so, um, let's, Okay, let's age six plus five out of five stars. It actually, it's actually a good game. It's a free-to-play subs subscription-based game. What to do? What do your parents think? It's going to be completely free for your wallets. No, it's not. Nothing is really. 
Uh, holy crap, that's long. Okay, I'll just read that. <laughs> um, well, it is free to level 5, and that's about it. Let's read one more, and then, yeah. Age 9 plus, 1 out of 5 stars. Eh, not, oh, I've already seen that. Actually, I'll do another one. Sorry, guys. I'm dumb. Hold on. Because I've seen these on YouTubers. They'll read them. Where's a 1 out of 5 stars? Can I go up and look at 1 out of 5 stars? Uh, okay, um, let's find one out of five stars, guys. Uh, uh, two out of five stars. Um, age 13 plus, two out of five stars. Absolutely time-wasting. I think it's a good game, but when you're a higher level, it's starting to be boring. You need to wait so much time to open new areas, and if you aren't in Star Rider, you can't open them. It costs... <laughs> its cost is very high, and... It's just the lags and glitches. Plus you plus when you start to play, I didn't know how to play. And my horse is very slow. It takes thirty minutes to do one quest. So you do one quest in thirty minutes, or you need to wait two to three days to do the quest completely. But you need to pay and you and you haven't gotten much quests. And you can't write simple words to chat because you've been banned for one, three, seven, or fourteen days. I think I'm I think I'm also in a community, but I'm not in any writing clubs. I'm abs It's absolutely time wasting. It doesn't take 30 minutes to do a quest. Well, I think she's exaggerating. Uh, I don't know how to say it. A little bit because it takes maybe five minutes to do one quest. I don't think it takes 30. Maybe like five quests take 30 minutes. Like if you did five quests, then it would probably... Like, at a time that it'll probably take 30 minutes. <laughs> I don't think you can do that, but still, I think you can. But, yeah. Um, yeah, I think, yeah, so, um, guys, if you, please, like, like, make your, I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, smash that like button, and, yeah. I hope you liked the video, guys, and I'll make another Star Stable video, maybe, if I have time. I don't like making Star Stable videos. I might make a video on buying a new horse or something. So, I'll see you guys later. Bye!